So we're going off for a weekend away this weekend um, and I've decided to bring the rod so let's see how this goes. Just walk right out the door Don't want to do this anymore Now I'm lost without you You drive me crazy out my mind How'd you do this every time? Now I'm lost without you You still be the one I talk to when I'm sad can you see that tainted love is all we have? Our issues run so deep, now when I try to sleep I feel so bad I should leave and by the time yeah. Alright, now we did it From this lovely jacuzzi I went down there I did some sort of slide skill thing, straight into the fence, straight down there, no shoes on, and I got one. Oh, oh God. Right, one minute. From jacuzzi to a fish in seconds. It's great. Woo! So unfortunately, the whole weekend, Josh only had the one fish. So one day after work, I decided to go up to Josh's and we decided to just make a quick one hour trip down to the local lake which starred in episode one and three of the Fishing Diaries. Right, so we've decided that we're gonna go and uh, do a bit of fishing for an hour. Go up to Josh's after work, it's about five o'clock now. Uh, gonna just take a couple of rods, do a bit of roach fishing which we, at the same lake we went to on episode three of the Fishing Diaries. So for episode six, we thought we'd go back there. Right. Yeah, man. Day to look in that bucket. I'm good, mate. <laughs> Day. I'm good, mate. Do you want to explain why that bucket down there, that bucket right there, is a bit dangerous? Cameron's fault he did it. I didn't do anything, mate. Wasn't me, mate. Whatever. Wasn't me. <laughs> Wasn't me. It's a never. What? I have no idea, mate. What are you doing? 900 months of mould. <laughs> nah. We show the view, is it, bro? I ain't going nit. Oh, I mean, you can. Oh, oh mate, I might vom everywhere. Are you actually gonna? I'm scared, bro. I'm scared. See the camera. <laughs> I don't want to go near that thing, bro. I don't want to go near that thing, bro. I'm scared to go inside that. Let me not have a focus. <laughs> right, so. Uh, when we first started the. Um, Channel. No, 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 no. When we first started the hunt for a 20 pound car, mm -hmm. um, we did actually do a few, a couple of nights down at Shattersford Lakes up near Kidderminster. Yeah. Um, we made some ground bait. We put in there sweet corn, meaty garlic boilies, uh, breadcrumbs, uh, ground bait, dog food. Just mush it all off and put it into this one bucket, which is that bucket there. We barely used any of the ground bait. It's still in there. Now, we went to Shattersford a few months before the first session on the Hunt for a 20. So if you look at the Hunt for a 20 and look at the date in the bottom left hand corner, it was before that. That is disgusting. You can do it, bro. <laughs> I might bomb. <laughs> bro, I'm going to Don't be scared. I'm going to get coronavirus from this. It'll be alright. <laughs> Let's <laughs> quarantine it. Put some tape around it or something, man. Woo! Bro, I can smell it from here. Just don't sniff, bro. Oh. No, no. Got everything? Indeed, I have. Cool. Let's go. That mate, I just nearly That was it, disgusting. Mate. The old car. Chicken nuggets box wasn't mine, mate. Where are we going, mate? What are we doing? We're having some well, fun. We're gonna go to the shop, get some bread, try and forget about what was in that bucket. <laughs> <laughs> um, 
go to the lake, just have a bit of fun fishing, get some roach or something, I don't know. Yeah, so um, we haven't been fishing for ages. Speak for yourself, mate. <laughs> but we'll catch you guys when we are at the lake. Alright. Right, that'll do it, won't it? Yeah, man. But all 99p. Can't Sorry. beat it, mate. Can't beat it. So guys, um, we've just got to, the lake is just up here near the fence, just walked all the way down this path and realised we forgot the bread of sweet corn. We've been walking down here and we're like damn how do we get back over the fence? Big old Cameron Giddis over here finds a little sneaky hack, are you guys ready for this? Have you managed that one then, bro? I've got no ass, mate. Left me. Let's go. That's pretty carpy. Watch me fall flat on my ass. Oh, someone's been getting on the vodka. To be fair, it's normally Josh that falls flat on his ass here. What I like about this lake, you just see straight to the bottom. One, two, Three, four, someone's had a mad sesh, you know? <laughs> oh. Takes ages to set up, doesn't it, bro? Yeah. Who am I getting a phone call off then? You got Macy. Oh, what? No idea. Hello? Who's me? Oh, hello. You're right. 2,000 years later. Right, okay. Literally, I think all fish packed their f***ing bags last Wednesday. I don't know why last Wednesday they f***ing did, right? Off that way, it's gone, mate. Got better chances of fing catching a piece of gold out this way than a fish. <laughs> How does the bread taste, mate? <laughs> Bro. Bro, that's fishing bait, stop it. Uh, <laughs> sweet corn juice. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so, when you're uh, not good at fishing, here's another tip. So, we last, last video we did, we did the <laughs> over the ear. Uh, you use the over the uh, bread thing, that catches your fish. Obviously why we haven't been catching today. Got all this bread left, simply. Give it to the fish, play a bit of fruit. Nah, nah, I need two more, bro. I need two more. Absolutely launch them, bro. Ah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, that skimmed your head. <laughs> Bro, no, now look now. Fat carp will come and take them. The only thing fat, fat about this lake is the guy sat next to it. You. We're <laughs> <laughs> fishing today. Me and Cameron are taking down a shed. This is what we do in our spare time. Let's see how it goes. Right, uh, shut up. I'm trying to film. Yeah, so today we were. Our original plans were go to McDonald's. <laughs> That's what I tell me to bark up. Oh, uh, you alright? Uh, we are training for you, so we can't do a space. Bring it. Right, okay, it. cheers. Give me a pen on the throat. How carp is that, bro? Let me launch your urchin, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Twat around the nose. That is Jay's car, I'm walking into Matthew's, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get down his balls. <laughs> Need to open and bring my food. 
Fucking hell, she's a unit, mate. She had the right chassis on the go. Raw, bro! Someone's clotted their head into the window screen. This whole clip's staying in the video, by the way, to prove how long the McDonald's are! Someone like your mom. Nothing's coming up here. I didn't want to see it. What, mate? Good morning. Good morning, you're right. You, it's alright, thank you. Get our breakfast, come back here. Then I was going to go up to my mom's house because we were going to start taking the shed apart as I was bringing the shed here. Sat there and we were like, nah, let's go fishing. So we're going to get stuff ready and go fishing now. Today, me and Macy have come through the cup room. <laughs> Josh, the poor fella. It's <laughs> a wedge ass, bro. I don't want bollocks to go on there. <laughs> Bro, you got through the other day. It's the cock stuff. <laughs> Bro. Squeeze, bro. Breathe in. <laughs> Catch you in a minute, mate. I'll see you in a bit, bro. Stay All right, bro. No. Is that fucking McDonald's this morning? <laughs> only been waiting five minutes. Bro, if you go take a <laughs> Yeah. I think you'll get through. Maybe. You'll have to try it. You'll have to do one at the lake, bro. I went through this way last time, though. Yeah, I know. Maybe it's because of smoother edges. <laughs> I just glided through like butter. <laughs> Tell the viewers what we're going to be using for bait. Um, if you turn the camera on and look in between your crotch, that's what we're using, mate. <laughs> bro, we're only trying to catch roads, bro. We're not catching gator gars and stuff. Ah, <laughs> funny maggot penis. Yeah. I need a hook. You are a hooker. No, you cut it off. Oh. Right guys, so we've come down the lake, uh, been here a few minutes now, um, I'm set up with, here you go, let me, let me show you guys what I've got. Don't give me my rod back please, bush. So all I've got guys is a float, a couple BB shots, down to a hook and a couple of focus, a couple of maggots. Um, I'm at the same spot where I had the purge in episode one, I want to say. So, uh, let's see if we can get anything. Seems to be a really tough day today, guys. Um, yeah. Haven't had any bites yet. We're going to recast here. Go have a walk around the lake and see Joff walk. That's what he told me to break my leg on the first episode of the Fishing Diaries. Rare specimen in his natural habitat over there. <laughs> oh, look. oh, she's caught a stick. Oh, fuck's sake. Did as well, then. Right, guys, so, um. I think the plan is we're gonna take a move. I don't know where we're gonna go yet. I'm gonna try and convince Cameron to take us to Brosley. He wants to go to Appley and actually get the car rods out, but I don't think there's much enough time, or and it's freezing. So I'm gonna try and convince him to take us to uh to Brosy. Let's see what he says. Let's take a trip. Woo, nearly died. The viewers want to ask you something, mate. So the viewers, I've just been speaking to them, right? And they've said to me that there's a lake we haven't filmed doing it, filmed that in a while. And they wanna see us there, mate. And they said they wanna see us go Brosley. I I mate, they just told me. Yeah, mate, you go there and you don't catch anything. I've wasted all that fuel and all them miles. Didn't they, Macy? Macy heard them. We need a new lake, right, bro. We need something new. Need something new? Mm. I've never been to Brosley before, have you? <laughs> Wanna go there? <laughs> and, uh, What's Brosley? <laughs> I don't know, you need a passport to get into that place. So we ended up catching no fish there, again. Thought we'd attempt it again after the other night and nothing. Attempt number two. Are you mad? <laughs> what? Are you well, mad? You lost weight from. <laughs> Bro, are you mad? I could just. Try and get through. Try and get through now. No, I can't. It's this. It's because these are smooth. And I just slide through. I just slip through like I'm greasy. <laughs> 